This is Odin's Wolf Survival, and it's a late Sunday night again. It's starting to get towards dark. This is what I've got on the shelter bit so far. I've built up the kiln quite a lot. I've been more mining clay than actually working on the shelter a great deal. I got the double layer of the roof on with cedar logs sewn down the sides and the front. I need one more for the back that I haven't got yet. But everything is pretty well woven in. There's the kiln. Well, soon to be. It needs to grow a little taller. And my supervisor. The table. And all this is done with very basic hand tools. No power, no even hauling it, it's in the buckets with me. So everything I've found so far has been within a 250 meter circle of here, which that can be quite a ways with full buckets. I started mudding up the back wall. We just stepped through the door. You can see it there a little bit. It's hanging in pretty good. We'll get an outside view. But this is inside. That rock hanging was to hold the corner down for a bit. Okay, this is the back. And that's what I've got plastered up so far. I need to do the back of the shelter, roll it up under a log and tie it down. That'll cut the wind flapping. That needs to get tucked under. My liter and a half water bottle. more clay to be adding to the top and well he did find a pile of grass that I'm using but that's the shelter so far and the fire pit that morphed into a kiln which means I need to build another fire pit I'm going to epoxy this and probably cut a big rock to hold it I kind of just kind of like the looks of it Alright, this is Todd Jaderborg with Odin's Wolf Survival. Be ready, stay alive.